Hi. In this video, we'll talk about cordless screwdrivers and what you need to know when choosing them. In stores, a large assortment of screwdrivers of various companies and price ranges is presented, but they all have specific characteristics and differences. In this review, we will understand the nuances of this power tool and determine the main criteria for its selection. Let's consider the pros and cons of this tool, so that it would be easier for an ordinary buyer to choose exactly what he needs without overpaying for extra functionality. Those who do not like to delve into something for a long time may not watch this video to the end. To the question, what you need to know when choosing a screwdriver, in short, we can say so, power and a good battery. Well, who wants to know more and save money by buying exactly what he needs? Watch this video to the end, so, let's go. The first thing you need to decide is to understand what kind of device is needed for your purposes, powered by a battery or from an electrical network. Battery or power outlet. Where the availability of power grids is not always at hand, or constant movement is required, whether indoors or outdoors, a cordless screwdriver is an indispensable tool. Its main merit lies precisely in mobility, because such a screwdriver does not pull an electric cable with it, which constantly gets tangled underfoot. The network screwdriver, by its design, is tied to an outlet, it is rather convenient for work, where constant movement is not required and is ideal for working in one place, for example, on an assembly line or for one-time work in the house. The main merit of the main screwdriver is that it does not require charging and is always ready to work where there is an electrical outlet. Another plus is its cheapness, with relatively good torque power compared to the battery analog, in which the battery and charger take the lion's share of the cost. The cordless screwdriver combines several tools, this is a drill with which you can drill holes in metal and wood without fear of discharging the battery, and a screwdriver with which you can screw screws and small bolts. By the way, the criterion when choosing a network screwdriver is the length of the cable, the longer the better. Therefore, the first thing to do is to understand. What is more important to you? Mobility a cordless screwdriver, or constant readiness for work and a relatively low price, a network device. Having decided on the choice of a power source, mains or battery, we will further consider the characteristics inherent in both types, as well as talk about the batteries themselves. When choosing a battery device, you should pay special attention to the characteristics of the battery itself. The battery in the tool plays a very important role, both the operating time and the service life of the tool as a whole depend on it. Battery There are two main types of screwdriver batteries, these are NICD and the more modern Li-Ion, which is gradually replacing its predecessor. NICD battery NICD battery, despite its relatively low price, has many significant drawbacks. Not constant power. Unstable power due to the fact that during the operation of the screwdriver with a gradual discharge of the battery, there is a decrease in the power of the screwdriver. Probably everyone is familiar with the situation with children's toys, in which the batteries are already half discharged, the movements of such a toy become slower and slower. Fast self-discharge a NICD battery is not capable of holding a charge for a long time, and if you leave a fully charged screwdriver with such a battery, and even in a cold room, then most likely in a few days it will already be half, if not completely discharged. Memory effect Another significant disadvantage of NICD batteries is the so-called, memory effect. The memory effect manifests itself in the event of incorrect charging, since a NICD battery must always be completely discharged before being charged. Otherwise, an incompletely discharged battery, during subsequent charging, receives a layer of charge, the battery voltage is partially reduced, the device controller considers the device to be discharged, and the user begins to recharge the battery again and again, thereby killing the battery. In some cases, the memory effect is reversible, it is simply necessary to carry out several full charge and discharge cycles for the battery. The only plus of the NICD battery is the low price, but now, more and more manufacturers are switching to a newer Leon type of batteries, and the range of screwdrivers with NICD batteries is getting smaller and smaller. 
Therefore, having made a choice in favor of a screwdriver with a NICD battery, make sure when buying that there are at least two batteries in the kit, and the charger works on the principle of discharge, charge. Li-ion, battery. Li-ion battery, does not have a, memory effect, however, it also has its drawbacks, the main of which is the high price, and a decrease in capacity in the cold. The discharge of the Li-ion battery is monitored by a controller built into the battery case, the controller does not allow the power source to be discharged below a certain value. But in the event that the monitoring system fails and the battery goes into deep discharge, such a heavily discharged battery should be charged with ordinary charger will fail. The undoubted advantage of Li-ion sources is their high energy capacity with small dimensions. In addition to the chemical type, screwdriver batteries differ in voltage, which, depending on the model, can be from 10 to 36 volts. The more batteries there are in the battery case, the higher the voltage is generated by the battery. As a rule, with a higher voltage, the power of the screwdriver itself also increases. Therefore, if you need a more powerful tool, take a closer look at the 18 volt models. An important factor is such a parameter as the capacity of the battery itself, which is measured in ampere hours AH. The higher the capacity, the longer it can serve in a working cycle from charging to full discharge, or, to put it simply, the more screws can be screwed on one battery charge. It should be borne in mind that the large capacity of the battery increases its size and weight, which is not always convenient, for example, when working on weight or in cramped conditions. An important factor is such a parameter as the capacity of the battery itself, which is measured in ampere hours AH. Screwdriver Torque One of the main tasks of a screwdriver is screwing self-tapping screws into a hard surface. It depends on the power, or rather the torque of the tool, how long the self-tapping screw you can screw into dense wood. The most important characteristic in terms of its importance is the torque, which is measured in nm Newton meters. Of the screwdrivers presented in the trade, the most common models are with a torque of 11 to 50 Newton meters. There are models of 100 Newton meters and more. And if a screwdriver with a torque of 11 Newton meters allows you to screw short self-tapping screws into not very dense materials, then a screwdriver, for example, Having a torque of 36 nanometers is already a fairly serious tool capable of screwing 100 millimeters screws into raw wood. If you are not engaged in construction, and you need a tool purely for domestic purposes, occasionally assemble furniture, screw in, unscrew small self-tapping screws, or drill a small hole, it makes no sense to look at models with a large torque, since their price is much higher than a conventional household device for episodic work and the device with a capacity of about 24 newton meters will cope with all simple household issues. Well, if you need to drill holes in metal. AL though it is better to use a drill for this. Work with a feather or a crown, tighten long screws in a lot, then it is better to choose more torque, closer to 50 newton meters. Brushless motor. Technologies, as they say, do not stand still, and now, relatively recently, the so-called brushless or brushless motors have appeared as an alternative to the classic brush motors. Certainly, screwdrivers equipped with such motors have smaller dimensions, and have an increased operating time due to a decrease in energy consumption, also, such screwdrivers are characterized by greater power. A significant disadvantage of this option, but perhaps only for now, is the high price that one has to pay for innovative technologies. Brushless screwdrivers belong to the expensive or rather more professional segment. Perhaps over time, and with the displacement of the classic, brush models from the market, there will be a redistribution of popularity in their direction. Torque Force Regulator most screwdrivers are equipped with a torque force regulator, ranging from small, for baiting a self-tapping screw into large when drilling a hole or screwing in long screws. 
the number of adjustable force positions can vary from 5 or more. By setting the required amount of torque, you get rid of such problems as loosening of fasteners, breaking off the head or pressing the head into the material. The more steps of torque, the more accurately you can adjust the required force, after which the rotation of the chuck will stop and the protection in the form of a ratchet will work. Rotational speed If you purchase a screwdriver not only for tightening fasteners, but also sometimes plan to drill holes, then such a parameter as rotation speed, measured in revolutions per minute, must be taken into account when forming an opinion in choosing a tool. The speed required for screwing in the fasteners varies from 300 to 500 revolutions per minute, and the speed for drilling is needed much higher, and in most models it still does not exceed 1300 revolutions per minute. Some models of screwdrivers have a speed reducer that allows you to change the rotation speed using a switch. Drill Chuck Almost all models of modern screwdrivers are equipped with a keyless chuck, which allows quick replacement of equipment during operation. The most common clamping diameter in the chuck is 10 mm. Some models of screwdriver are produced only for work with special hexagonal equipment hex 1 quarter inch, where you can insert standard bits or any other equipment that has a hexagonal shank. Spindle lock. Another plus in convenience when working with a screwdriver is the spindle lock. Thanks to this function, it is very convenient to clamp the chuck, since the shaft automatically locks in a stopped state and does not turn. LED lights Some people think that LED backlighting is useless because it shines dimly, only in one place and sometimes in the wrong place. I disagree with such arguments, backlighting is far from being a superfluous option in a screwdriver, if, for example, something needs to be screwed or drilled in a dimly lit room. It is not possible to put a lamp everywhere, because sometimes you have to work in hard to reach places. And to screw in the screw, this backlight is enough. Clamp. This pleasant little thing becomes indispensable for professionals when their hands are busy, when working at a height or in another situation when there is often nowhere to put or put the tool. Saves the clamp, and with which the screwdriver can be hooked onto the belt. Rubberized body. The comfortable rubberized and non-slip grip will definitely increase the comfort when working and reduce the number of tool falls from the hands. Rubber dampers and all kinds of pads will protect surfaces, floor coverings, furniture, as well as the screwdriver body itself from unwanted contacts and possibly even from impact when falling. Equipment When choosing, you should pay attention to the complete set of the screwdriver. Certainly, with all the good and bad sides of a power tool, such useful things as an additional battery, a flashlight, or the presence of a hard case can help to tilt the scales in favor of a particular model. Service and spare parts. And, of course, having given preference to one or another model of a screwdriver, do not forget that the tool may need repair or maintenance. For most well-known brands, service has become global. But it also happens, and the necessary spare parts may not be found for the tool, due to its discontinuation from production or, on the contrary, the novelty of the model. Common breakdowns of cordless screwdrivers. The most frequent breakdowns of a screwdriver are where of the gearbox or motor brushes, it happens that the motor itself fails. Backlash in the chuck most likely indicates the wear of the gearbox or the chuck itself. Very often, a screwdriver breaks down and requires replacement of the battery, especially the Nika. Study the internet and contact the service centers before purchasing the selected model, ask the service if there are at least the parts listed above for them. Find out if there are originals or analogs of batteries for your chosen model on sale. When choosing a screwdriver, try to push off from the required functionality, and having already received a complete picture of what you need, choose and compare manufacturers. Sometimes there are unprofessional reviews about tools, and after reading a lot of good things and buying a thing, 
People are disappointed, this is certainly not a rule, but trust only trusted sources, learn to separate the grains from the chaff. That's all, subscribe, I wish that your instrument would always be in good working order and please you, good luck to everyone and see you soon.